Hi, Claude Pallon here at Affiliate Starting Line. Welcome. Another YouTube video. This one, let's do a short one on how you embed YouTube code to place a video into your WordPress website. So let's say you have a website and it's about chocolate. And you go to YouTube and you type in chocolate pudding in your search box. It brings you back some results. Uh, you can, by the way, you have different search uh, options you can do and you can use in uh, YouTube under the search title you're, you're looking for. Uh, I'm, these are my uh, standard search results that are coming up and I see one here that says how to make chocolate pudding. Uh, it's a minute 18. That's a great, uh, I like those. I like the nice short sweet ones, especially when it's about re recipes. So I come over here to take a look at it. And, you know, I screened it. You screen it. Uh, How to make chocolate pudding. Chocolate pudding is a popular and delicious dessert. And, e and it's a great way, uh, you know, there, there's a quick way here to learn how to do it. And it looked delicious. And as a matter of fact, I plan on doing this. Now, you're going to notice below the video, you can like and dislike it. There is a description tag. I've done in other videos, I've shown you how to optimize your description, and they've done a nice job here. They give you the recipe. They give you a, a uh, link to their website, and they give you additional links. Uh, to. So this is a very well-optimized description. Uh, you can see data down here. We've talked about that. And you can see that the appeal here is female, 13 to 24, male, 45, 54. That's interesting. Uh, and then right below the view statistics is the embed code. You select your embed code, and you, then you have you can select certain options here about including related videos. I don't do that. I like to show a border. Uh, you can enhance privacy. I like to select HD if it's available. And then you can pick your format. Uh, for the WordPress blog, I, can, I pick the, the smallest one because I know that'll fit into my post box. Uh, now it's going to give me a certain width here if it's in HD. Uh, let me think. I don't. I guess I don't want that. I'm going to have to go back here and select this. Let's see if this does it. Yeah. So I can't select HD because it's going to be, the format's going to be too wide for my post box. So we stick with 580 by 360. But you notice if, if as I click through the different formats, the code changes. So let's let's stick with the 580 by 360, we're going to go with that. We select the code and we control C and copy it. Now you want to go to your website dashboard, and in this case a WordPress dashboard, and you want to come in here to new posts and you want to click your add new post and you can see here there's a title box, there's a, a text box. You want to make sure that you're not in text, you're in HTML. You want to come into your HTML and deposit your code. Now you want to put a title. Let's, uh, let's call this How to Make Chocolate Pudding. You want to put some tags in. And let's put a tag that is like the title. You want to add other tags as well, like chocolate pudding, chocolate pudding recipe. I mean, also you know, you add your tags. Uh, you want to come down here if you and put your SEO information in 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 WordPress. Uh, you have a plugin that will allow you to put in um, keywords titles, a description, etc. So you fill this with uh, keyword rich recipe. You do your homework before you go in, come in here. And so now uh, we're optimized. We've had it dropped in. I'm going to save the draft and let's preview it. And here you have 
the recipe that's right into uh, your display box. Now it's a little overreaching here, so I think I'm, I'm going to try and see if maybe I can change the format. But that's how you drop an embed code into your post and get it into your website. If I click it, there it is. It's going to play. How to make chocolate pudding. So that, that's how you take uh, an embed code from YouTube under the embed box, that, how you select certain options and if you want a border, how you select the size of your format, how you come over to your post area, you make sure you're in HTML, you drop it in, you optimize, you publish, and you're there. That's how you do it. Hope this has been helpful. This is Claude Pallon, Affiliate Starting Line. Stay with it. Stay well. Talk to you soon.